Hi everyone and welcome day 23 in the fuel series and today it's tempo work, glutes and hamstrings. The timer today is going to vary so it may be 30 seconds of work followed by 30 seconds of work a superset, it may be a triset or it may be just one exercise for 60 seconds. The rest period throughout today's workout will be 30 seconds. All you'll need for today's workout is some resistance, also a glute band, I'm gonna place mine just above the knees for those hip thrusts. I also use a towel to place under the dumbbell for the hip thrusts. I'll be using this chair behind me, however you can also use a bench or a stepper if you prefer, you can also perform bridges on the mat. The dumbbells I'm using for your reference, I'm using two 15 kg each dumbbells for Romanian deadlifts, but everything else, every time I'm using a dumbbell, it will be one dumbbell, 30 kg. There is a wee staple in today's workout, as you can see here. It is 30 seconds of sumo jumps or explosive sumos up to your toes. You're really gonna explode if you prefer to do that no jumping option. We do that for 30 seconds. Then we're gonna take those few seconds to get into position. We're going to lift the dumbbell. We're gonna lower into a sumo deadlift squat hold at the bottom for those 30 seconds. We then, once that 30 seconds is over, you're gonna try and drive up, then set the dumbbell down, back into those sumo squat jumps or the explosive sumos. And this table will appear four times in total throughout the workout. So today it's tempo work, definitely one of my favorites to incorporate into a wide variety of my training, whether it's resistance training or running. Today we're gonna to work through a variety of tempos. It could be slow on the eccentric, fast on the concentric. It could be isometrics where we're actually just no tempo holding it. It could be simple, slow reps. It could be faster pace reps, or it could be those explosive sumos. This is a lower body workout. However, we're gonna zone in on those glutes and hamstrings. Remember, seek the challenge, make it as challenging as you can. Wearing the band, push against it. Hip thrust, full contraction at the top, slow release. RDLs, keep the chest open, shoulders back, push the hips back, dumbbells close to the body as you lower, let the hamstrings dictate as to how low you go, but also keep that back intact, then come up. And I think that's it. This is packed with lots of our favorite exercises. Let's go.